Hi kids! The Average Gamer has returned for another part of our playthrough of Spider-Man PS4. And when we last left off... I don't remember. Yuri, who would be dumb enough to rob Fisk's estate sale? Oh yeah. Okay, now I remember. Cool. When we last left off, we were about to check out the, uh estate sale for uh, Wilson Fisk because someone is trying to rob it. Now I remember. Thank you, game. Yeah, so when we last left off, I upgraded a few of my abilities here. Glad I did that. And, uh, we've got a couple of upgrades for gadgets here. Not a whole lot. But I wanted to stop here because this mission might take a little while. So, let's get to it. If this is the mission I'm thinking about. I am losing patience. Where is the file. There's someone else here. They must have taken it. Those masks. Who are these guys? There's no one here but us. We will find the file. Or you will die. This is bad. They'll kill her if I alert them. I need to pick them off silently. Yuri, the silent alarm was legit. Masked gunmen and a single hostage. Looks like a heist in progress. Copy that. Sending units your way. Keep the situation from getting worse in the meantime. Can do. This reminds me of old school Metal Gear Solid. Gotta do this quietly. Don't want to alert the others. <laughs> Look so cozy whipped up like that. Should web him from above. Guys are getting ready to be bad. Literally didn't see that coming. Hey, what is that? This totally belongs to... Don't move! Buddy, if I had a nickel for every don't move... Hey, Pete. MJ? What are you doing here? Same as you. Working. At least... I was. 
Oh, I, uh, think this is yours. Yeah, thanks. So, Robbie's got you covering a break-in for the Bugle? Well, Robbie doesn't technically know I'm here. And it wasn't a break-in until a few minutes ago. Uh, uh-huh. Let me explain. <clears throat> and... Here's the first of many sequences where we will be playing as someone other than Peter. In this case, Mary Jane. I am a bit curious as to why his spider sense didn't tell him that guy was behind him, but we'll let it go. Uh, excuse me. Hi, Mary Jane Watson. I am covering the Fisk estate sale. Hello. Craig said we'd do this tomorrow. I like to get a jump on things. Well, I don't. You'll have to come back tomorrow. Right. Okay. I'm sorry. Hey, Craig? No, sorry, it just... It looks like we're gonna have to run something else on the cover. I don't know, uh... Maybe the expressionist piece? You know what? I think I can make today work. Are you sure? You're here. No moment like the present. Thank you. Craig? Never mind. We're good. Let's get started. Look around and familiarize yourself with the items. I'll be waiting by the box. Oh, MJ, you sneaky Pete. Can do. <clears throat> well, this part is kind of cool. Again, more that world world building I talked about so much. I get why Peter does it, but I never totally loved the heroes hiding behind masks thing. Feels like part of being a hero is standing behind your actions, being willing to say, yeah, that was me. That's the sort of hero I'd want to be, at least. So all this crap was owned by the Kingpin. And apparently they're about to auction off his stuff. Which is kind of cool, because if you're a fan of his from the comics, then you know Kingpin did spend a lot of time in Japan and has a love for their culture. Bedfisk saw himself in this. A great man willing to do what others wouldn't. Dude had no self-awareness. Fisk cut Peter open like a pork sausage with this the first time they fought. Pete got away, collapsed in my yard half dead, and I had to steal my dad's car to drive him to the ER. The first of many Nurse MJ moments. Too many. That is scary and depressing. Also, this really is that legendary sword. Fisk really shouldn't be using it in a fight. I remember when Fisk started illegally importing artifacts like this. He bought the local harbor to cover his tracks and laid off the old staff, including my dad. Wish dad was here now to see how the tables have turned. Sometimes I feel like the whole history of the world is just Boys playing dress up, getting into fights. Hmm. Simcaria. Weren't they just in the news? Simcaria is going to play a major role in the story later once we get to the DLC, which, yes, I will be playing the DLC chapters. <clears throat> and yes, you will be seeing... Silver Sable. I can't get over this image. So much tension between these two figures. Let me know when you're ready to begin. Sounds good. What did Fisk call this? Vanessa? Huh. 
Always hated this cane. So tacky. Heard from the underworld, huh? Super tempted to ring this guy. May would love this. I gotta admit, I miss May. How much am I bid for this collection of villainy and deceit, starting at 10,000 broken lives and dreams? 10,000 going once. I gotta say I love MJ's characterization in this game. But that's enough sightseeing, let's get on with it. Starting with the prize, a one-of-a-kind Kake Monbaku. Oh, beautiful. It's a Mifune? Correct. Mr. Fisk has exceptional taste. Did you know him well before his arrest? In a professional context. I handled many of his sales. Let's move on, please. Now, this exquisite piece exemplifies the traditional Tarashikomi puddled ink effect. The two Neo are so imposing. I can see why Fisk liked this piece. Definitely his style. He loved the duality. Destruction screams, but creation toils in silence. Was there ever anything irregular in any of the sales you handled for him? No. No, of, of course not. Not that I was aware of. Notice the intricate gold inlay on this ceremonial tea set. It's just... A friend in the DA's office mentioned that Fisk used art sales to launder stolen goods. I'm... sure I wouldn't know anything about that. Oh, I know. I was just wondering, now that he's arrested, if you had ever noticed anything... strange. You know what? I'm actually running short of time. Why don't we grab the cover photo while we can? When I told my DA friend I was doing a piece on you, he mentioned your name was familiar. Just the photo, please. Stand right there. Are you sure there's nothing you'd like to say, maybe off the record, regarding Fisk's activities? I don't think your readers would have any interest in... Damn it. Wait here, please. Wait. I recognize that statue. I gotta get a photo. That... Shouldn't be here, got it. Craig, I'll call you back. My dear, I think it's time for you to go. Oh, um, could I use the restroom real quick? Fine, follow me. Thank you. This, this is a really lovely space. It is, and this will be the last time you see it. The ladies is around the corner. Be quick. Of course. Be right back. Hello, Craig. Funny you should call. Because the reporter you sent is clearly not working the puff piece we agreed upon. No, she's here now. I've got to get into that back room. If that statue is what I think it is, this just turned into a huge story. What do you mean he had to reschedule? <clears throat> and this is the first of many stealth sections like featuring Mary Jane. So we got to be very careful getting from spot to spot without getting house. spotted. Got to wait for that lady to turn oh her back God. and make sure we don't make too much noise or knock anything over. No, I do not trust you to fix this. Well, the first thing I'm going to do is have Miss Investigative Journalist arrested. 
And the second thing I'm going to do is collect your head, Craig. Dang, she's pissed. It is most definitely a threat. Uh-huh. Sure, Craig. Right. Pete told me about this. Fisk used it to hide evidence. Why didn't the cops take it? I know this statue opens, but how? I wonder if there are any clues in here. That's the Neo behind them. But it looks different. something. A statue can move. Most common pose is latent power. Mouth closed, left arm down, right palm facing forward. Hmm. So, we need to Maybe alter the pose of the smoke. statue. Mouth closed. Left arm down. Maybe I should right turn the head. Forward. Nice. So close. But a piece is missing. these before that's it and puzzle salt Norman Osborne what is this devil's breath what is devil's Excuse me, sir. You you can't be not good. Where's the statue? In in in, in there. Ba Wen Jin Zhao Shu Lai. I was on my way to the exit when I saw you. You're lucky to be alive. This is the guy I saved five minutes ago. Listen, whoever these masked guys are, they're after this file. But I'll never get it out of here while the place is swarming with them. Right. Okay. Um, you hide back there. I take out the bad guys. You make a break when it's clear. Sounds like a plan. Good to see you, Pete. Yeah, you too. Not exactly how I pictured us meeting again, though. Funny. It's exactly how I pictured it. Did she change her perfume? Focus, Pete, focus. Yes. I didn't know any better. I swear he still loves her. Should clear these guys out before I push forward. Will do. How about that file? What's in it that these guys want so bad? Notes on something called Devil's Breath. Fisk was hired to build a secret research lab for it. Not clear what Devil's Breath is, but it seemed to scare Fisk. He compares it to Pandora's box. Not much shook Fisk. 
We need to get you and that file out of here. Hang tight. Gotta stay silent. There we go. forgot about. Didn't notice that guy. Cool. Okay, room is clear. Thanks. Direction. Easy does it. Mm, not the guy I wanted, but I might be able to get him. Yeah, no biggie. Bonk. Helps to just create a distraction. One room at a time. Clear this out before I continue. Nap time. That's all of them. No! Let me go! MJ! Guys. Whoa, what is up with that glowy stuff on your hands? Are you guys ghosts? Never fought a ghost before. I mean, I fought specters, but you know, technically specters aren't ghosts. All ghosts are specters, but not all specters are ghosts. You know what I mean? Like this is an energy thing, not a ghost thing. All good. Fight a ghost that stays on the old bucket list. Short work for him. More bad guys. Antique. I think I know someone who could help track down where this came from. A job for later. I just talked to Craig. 
You are not the reporter he was sending. You don't even work for Heritage Arts. Never said I did. Hi, Mary Jane Watson, Daily Bugle. You... You will not write a word of what you saw For the here. record, what do you know about the file those masked men stole? That... I, I don't... What about the long history of stolen goods Fisk has laundered at this auction house? Your editor will be hearing from our attorney. Mix? <laughs> like the last six months never happened? Well, that was a fun little auction. Since when did Mix become Italian? <laughs> no idea, but I'm still glad to mix these fries. Totally. Best in the city. So, how's the grind at the Bugle? Hmm. Well... Yeah, well, I just got an all-caps text from Robbie about my so-called antics tonight. So it looks like I'll be meeting with a legal team. Again. Uh, as soon as he reads the article you're gonna write, guaranteed promotion. So... Creepy mask, guys. What's your take? Just another night in the city. What's your take? I feel like there's a bigger story there. Let's not make this all about business. How's how's it going with you? Did did you get that promotion? No, but we're on the cusp of something really big. You know Oscorp would hire you in a heartbeat, right? One phone call to hair. Sure, but Dr. Octavius's work will help millions. I'm, I'm, I'm right where I want to be, right where I should be. Almost sounds like it's more important than your other job. I've never heard you talk like that before. A well, lot can change in six months. Why did you ask me here, Pete? You know, just, uh, just dinner between friends. Friends? Is that what we are? Well, maybe we could be, you know, if, if, if that's what you wanted. <laughs> There's a lot of baggage here. Yeah, sure, but... Is that so bad? I mean, baggage can carry good things, too, like, uh, like money and, uh, keys and raspberry lip balm. Do you remember why we broke up? This is a trick question, isn't it? Saved by the siren. As if on cue. Talk to you later. Go. Cool. I love seeing you two together again. You always were my favorites. I miss Stan. <clears throat> I feel there's something kind of meta there, too. To have Stan say they were his favorites. This was on the heels of Pete and MJ being broken up in the comics. Maybe it's just me being a nerd and, you know, wishful thinking. In any event, that's a good place to hey, call it a day. Me. What's with the units heading down third? Looks like our old friend Herman Schultz is at it again. Shocker. Didn't he just get paroled? Yeah, well, I guess it didn't take. No worries. Herman's just a big cupcake. I'll have him back in Rikers by bedtime. That's a good place to call it a day. When we come back, we're chasing after the Shocker. So, thanks for sticking around. And I'll see you next time we go after Vibrator Man himself. Till next time, take care.